Eddie, first things first, is uh, Anthony Crawler okay? Yeah, he's fine. Obviously, it was a heavy knockout, sort of temple shot that he didn't see. Um, you know, after obviously he was counting out, he got up, he's fine, he's, he's devastated. I mean, you know what he's like. He's, you know, when a fighter says, I'm just so good, you know, for the team and the work the team put in, I said, don't worry about the team. We just fought pound for pound number one. Oh, you know. And every, what everybody said to him, you know, Bob Arum, every fighter at ringside, there's no disgrace in that, mate. You know, you, you're a mandatory challenger, what are you going to do? You get the shot against Lomachenko, you've got to take it. And he was just too good. You know, the third round was a weird one. He was sort of sitting on the ropes. And I thought it was a really, I thought the ref had stopped the fight. I thought it was a poor stoppage. I know he wasn't particularly in the fight, but still, I thought it was a poor stoppage. And actually, when you watch it back, the ref was just giving him a count. And um, unfortunately, in the fourth round, I think Crawler knew that he had to do something. And he started to go for it. And when you do that against Lomachenko, you're just leaving yourself wide open with gaps, especially when you're not in the fight. And Lomachenko just showed what he is. Pound for pound, you know, top three fighter in the world. And he was, he was brilliant. And then he was just too good for Anthony. Any hints? Uh, no, it's very raw. Any hints on what Anthony will do next? No, I mean, look, this, this shot sort of came against the head, really. You know, he, he lost to Linares. He came back, boxed Ricky Burns, boxed the final eliminator that got him this opportunity. Obviously, he was going to take it. You can't not. Um, losing to Lomachenko is never a disgrace and I'm sure Anthony will have a recoup and you know all I say what I said in the interview earlier he got himself in the best shape possible so he can have absolutely zero regrets as an athlete he prepared the best he could have possibly prepared he was fitter than he could have possibly been he'd done the weight better than he could have ever have done it was just about levels and, and, but losing to Lomachenko is, not, is never a disgrace who is going to beat him I don't know so you know, I'm gutted to see him lose like that, but it's boxing, and you know he's, he stepped up to fight the very, very best, and you know he just wasn't good enough. Lomachenko was just outstanding. Thanks, Eddie.